All right, so the number one thing I absolutely hate the most, we're gonna go ahead and do first, and that's these guys. And I really wish somebody would standardize this damn thing, but whatever. So, let's go ahead and feed through here. I really cannot express how much I hate these things. So there's only a few that I'm worried about. I'm not worried about the network, which is why I have these set aside. Um, so we got power, reset, hard drive, and power switch. All right, and the nice thing about this one is that these are actually color coded on this motherboard. So we've got the power, or the motherboard cable uh, wired in. We've got the actual power uh, switches wired in. Now we're gonna do our PCIe power cable. That would be for the graphics card. All right, now in this case, this one has one built in. There are, if your power supply doesn't have one, uh, or your modular power supply didn't come with the right cables, then there are adapters you can buy that go from a regular uh, SATA or PETA power connector into one of these. Next we have, we're gonna pull this cable back over here. What I'm doing is I pull them right out through the front, so that way I can just tie them all up and tuck them. Now we need to get power cabling over here. All right, I'm just gonna leave that guy right there. So that's pretty much everything that I need for that one. Now the rest of these cables, I'm just gonna kind of wind them up, tuck them in, we're done there. Now we're gonna take our SATA cable. I like the 90 degree ones for obvious reasons. Connect it. Hey, congratulations, you've built a computer. Well, technically, watch me build a computer. Now let's boot it up and see if it catches on fire.